The next module that I am going to show you is the social follow module. This module is a new module that they just created with a ton of new social media buttons that allows you to customize the colors of the social buttons so you have total customization over the social buttons versus a social plugin where you only get the colors that they give you. So let's go ahead and come down and find the social buttons. There we go, social media follow. And we have rounded rectangle or circle. For this first one, we are going to do circle. We are going to, URL opens in the same window. Uh, usually you do opens in new tab because you're sending them away to another website. So you don't want that opening up in the same tab because that's gonna take them away from your site and they're not gonna click back to go back. So the follow button, you can have the follow button on or off. Uh, you can put this on so that people don't get confused on whether it's a share or a follow. So, for instance, if you have Twitter follow, Facebook follow, or Google Plus follow, you could turn this button on if that's where the link leads to so that they will know that this is a follow button. That way they won't get upset if they go to click like or plus one and all of a sudden they're taken away from the site. And yeah, we're just going to do circles and add social network. Let's add Facebook. Okay, and we can add them one by one. And so then we select the icon colors down here. I'm going to make mine all the light blue color I have on my templates so account URL um, for now I'm just going to put this in but this is where you would put your account URLs in for all of your accounts so Facebook Twitter Google Plus and it's automatically assigning them the colors that they originally have so but you don't have to keep the original color you can change the colors although it may be a good idea to keep the original colors as you may confuse people if you try to start changing the buttons to random different colors Go ahead and LinkedIn. Tumblr. Instagram. Skype. Flickr. MySpace, Dribble, YouTube, Vimeo, and RSS. So now let's go ahead and save. We'll go ahead and preview.
Let's go ahead and click preview again and refresh. There we go. And now you see we have all of the social media buttons right here where you can have all your URLs in and have it lead them to your URL. So I'm going to go through the other possible ways to lay it out as well. So we're going to go to the social media follow and this time we're going to choose rounded rectangle and just going to go ahead and add them all in The nice thing about this as well is as long as you're leading them to a like or share button on a network, this will take a lot less for it to load on the server than it will for some of the actual social plugins and components, which can take a lot more and slow down the page load time. Okay, now let's go ahead and save and preview. And here we have the rounded and here we have the squared. And then if I just hop over here to their demo, you can see that you can also do like them, change it to all one color if you wanted to. Uh, choose any color you want this one they're all the default colors <clears throat> and then you can also set each one of these to have a follow button so that if this leads to your follow section then when they click it they will be led to your follow and then you can use this with the rounded ones as well And then if you want a darker background, you can have a darker background with light text by setting the background to dark and setting a background color. And that is how you add the social media buttons and the follow buttons and do the colors.